Now with more on what we're going to see here today, let's go down to our gang in the pits. Today at the Speed World, some major air for the Pro 2 and the Pro 4 divisions, mostly courtesy of the suspension underneath the hood. On all four corners, Fox Racing shocks, Mr. Todd Tenbrook. Let's talk about these shocks on each corner. Basically what you have, and this is standard on all of them, is a coilover shock that is holding the spring that's used to hold the vehicle up for ride height. You have most of your major stuff done here with this bypass shock. As you can see, it's got bypass tubes that are all adjustable, rebound compression, and uh, free bleed. You've got 20 inches of travel, which is mandated by Lucas. We use this hydraulic bump stop here, and that's controlling the last little bit of the travel to keep it from bottoming out. And Todd is a very busy guy when he comes into the pits. Everyone's chasing him down on what they need to do to make their truck faster here at Speed World. Well, guys, the moguls are back. When you think of Speed World Raceway, the first thing that comes to mind is this mogul section. Two years ago, the Lucas Oil staff had to cut down these moguls because they were so tall and the drivers had a lot of safety complaints. But last year, they were so flat that the drivers seemed to almost skate across them. But this year, they have perfected this mogul section. They've separated and staggered these jumps, and these guys are going to have one of the most technical and exciting parts of a racetrack we have ever seen in this series. So two totally different stories from Kelly and Rob, but they tied together perfectly because shock setup will be critical to get through that rhythm section. Well, speed of the rhythm section and the rest of this track, take us for a lap, Cam.